Well, firstly, mobile money services have been very successful in Africa. We have the examples of Kenya and Tanzania where it's taken off very well. And we also have mobile money services in many African countries where we have over 130 million subscribers in over 37 countries. Now, there's still a long way to go. And governments have a very important role to play, especially the financial regulators. Well, firstly, mobile is not a luxury and governments can treat it, should treat it, as a public good and they can reduce the level of taxation on mobile services. Secondly, it's a shared responsibility between governments and the private sector to deploy the mobile networks that we all need. And thirdly, local content is very important and the internet exchange points need to be developed and deployed locally. Well, Spectrum is very important to, to mobile internet in Africa. So in Africa, the internet is mostly mobile because we do not have the fixed line infrastructure to support it. Now, we need Spectrum and more Spectrum because what we have currently is not sufficient to cater for the expected growth in data demand. We also need harmonized Spectrum and this would result in lower prices to the end users. Spectrum is very important for developing countries and we have some spectrum that has been identified, that's the digital dividend. We need to thus have it made available in Africa. Many African countries will miss the, will miss the digital switchover, which is the 17 June, and we encourage them to continue on that path and make the spectrum available as soon as possible.